I am Shamla. Welcome to Java Server Pages tutorial. In this tutorial, we will discuss about uh, implicit object, how we can request an implicit object. Uh, and also, we can achieve uh, requesting to an implicit object uh, of uh, type HTTP servlet request uh, uh, by, by using an uh, JSP as well as HTML file. And also in this tutorial, we will uh, look at uh, how to interact between HTML and uh, JSP uh, file, how we can uh, pass the messages uh, from uh, HTML file uh, to a JSP file. Go to web content. Click on new. Create a HTML file. give the name as index.html anything you want it, it's your wish index.html click on next I'm selecting HTML5 since HTML5 is the latest version click on furnish this is my index.html here uh, my a main intention is to uh, create a form create a form and also a text box so that it will take an uh, text as an input in the text box okay I'm creating a form with an action Here I need to give uh, the name of um, the another uh, server pages in which you want to interact uh, your HTML file with. So therefore, I'm creating and one more uh, file, JSP file, web content. I'm giving the name as hello dot JSP. Click on next. JSP with the HTML markup. Click on finish. I have created a hello.jsp as well as in index.html. As I said, I'm trying to interact HTML file with the JSP file. Inside the HTML file, I'm giving the name of the JSP file hello.jsp. Close the form. Uh, not now um, inside the form I'm writing um, input tag of type text it will create a text box I need to name it you can give um, whatever the name you want it's, it's just for identification so that we can pass the same name uh, in the JSP file I'm, cre I'm creating one more uh, input tag of type submit so once if I'm uh, writing a text box inside that if I'm giving the name as uh, Shamala and then I need to submit that button if I submit that button the output of that will be the input for the JSP file I will execute and um, show how it works uh, instead of uh, giving more explanation it's kind of confusing so I will explain with the output submit and name whatever we want we can give it's not a name actually when the type is submit uh, the second parameter should be a value okay we have ended the form and I'm adding a break over here line break okay this is about it and uh, coming to hello.jsp what I'm doing here is 
as I explained before inside the JSP body if you want to write some any Java code you need to make use of uh, this scripting uh, tags inside this I'm creating a string with the element anything whatever we want it's a kind of username so I'm giving it as username now I'm requesting to get a parameter what I have passed to the text box get parameter if I'm uh, passing Shamala in the text box if I'm writing that 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 parameter will be coming over here so you name whatever the name I have given here in the index.html what name I have given username we need to give the same name then only the name then only what uh, the text which I have given in the text box that box will be submitted and it will be stored in the u name that is the meaning of uh, this uh, function request dot get parameter here I'm making use of same name username terminate this out dot Print. I'm printing it on the screen now. Hello, and I'll give you a little space so that um, it should uh, type with the space username. Terminate with the colon. Try to execute the program now. okay why it is uh, showing uh, an error it's because we need to make use of uname because request.get parameter will be stored in uname so I should make changes over there it should be uname yeah once it is done there is no error over there go to index.html right click click on run as run on server okay click on okay next click on next click on finish once it is done this is the output what we are giving uh, what we are getting I'm giving Shamala inside the text box I'm giving the text name as Shamala then click on go uh, once you click on uh, the, the go button you will get the output as hello uh, Shamala why we have got like this it's because in the hello.jsp we are getting the parameter what we are passing uh, to the text box by using the request.get parameter and we are using the same username username over here and it will be stored in the uname at the output screen we are getting the output as hello uh, with the space the name username this is about uh, interaction of JSP with the HTML file thanks for watching the tutorial if you guys are having any doubts please the, uh, please leave the command and um, I'll see um, this is pretty much uh, about it I will see you guys in the next tutorial bye bye